Oh, 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 what is up, everyone? Welcome back to another One Piece Bounty Rush video. My name is D Free here today. We're going to be doing some summons for the man Law. Hope you guys enjoyed today's video. Hit that subscribe if you're new for more content. So we have Luano Law. So this is um scout number one. We know Zoro's coming. I don't know if they're going to drop any more characters from, from Wano, but we'll see. I mean, obviously they will, but I don't know if they're going to be like back to back to back. So we'll see what happens with that. But regardless, though, this is a step up scout. So the first couple of steps are 40 gems. First step guarantees you nothing. Second step actually guarantees a law, which is really cool. Third step is 50 and fourth step as well. Third step, however, only guarantees a four star character, not a law. But step four does guarantee a law. So you can at least pull a couple of laws in here. Uh, it's unfortunate they didn't do the same for step three, but this is still an incredibly good banner model that I hope that they do adopt on this game more often because it's very good. It's very generous and for the most part overall. So that being said, we're going to do some summons and we'll go from there. And towards the end of the video, we'll probably talk about law a little bit too and see how good he is. So for the record, he has a red defender unit as well. So let me know in the comment section down below how you guys' polls went, if you did any polls. Um, again, Zoro is coming, and there's a whole campaign with this too. Like, for example, um, they're going to have another event coming out soon where um, Basil Hawkins actually is playable too. So we'll see what happens with that. But regardless though, let's get into it. All right, so I have enough to do all these steps and probably one more afterwards. So the real trick though is to see if maybe we can get more than one law. <laughs> All the steps where he's guaranteed, right? Because he's going to pop in the very last spot. We're going to hope to see if he pops up more. So this is a rare instance where in videos, I actually get to ask for a defender flag. For the most part of my videos, I'm like, hey, no defender flags, right? I can finally ask for them. All right. So no runner flags. Oh, defender flag. Do it. Ah, okay. So yeah, on a side note, though, another one. I'm actually really excited for this, too, uh, because, again, more cola I can get. I'm still working on my uh, my ace before I do my gameplay video. I know some of you guys have been wondering where that's at. I'm still working on him. Okay. So far, nothing. So far, a whole lot of nothing. Is this first summon just going to just be a dud? It, it looks like looks like this first summon is just a dud, unfortunately. I think this is the last unit. Okay. This one, maybe. Okay, Usopp, we get it. Thanks. I get it, man. I, I get it, bro. Thank you, bro. <laughs> All right, let's go in again. So this one does guarantee a law. But if we can pull two laws, then we really we real good. All right. So even though Luffy runs in with the black fla uh, flag in the beginning, obviously we're still getting something. We could get multiple somethings. Multiple somethings. Uh, Nami, okay. And Tupa. Um, not going great. Not going great. Brooke is not who I'm looking for. Uh, neither are you. Law, do it, Law. Do it, Law. Ah. Ah, Vichy, why? Why have you forsaken me? Sanji. Oh. <laughs> Whoops. I thought, is that really the last unit already? Oh, we did actually get more than one. Oh. I was like, I was like, man, that's a little too soon for that to be the last unit. This one right here is probably it. There he is. Hey! There we go. Oh, baby. That's what I was talking about. Like, if we can get, you know, maybe one more or something, we're good. So, I need to back out here, and I'm going to kind of talk for a second here. So, again, this step just says, um, I was actually, I actually mis misread this at first myself. This one says here, just four-star character guaranteed, not new character. Oh, um, so since that's the case, if you're wondering, there's a good bit of characters here. The good news is Law is weighted. He's at 1%. The other characters aren't. So there's uh, the Frankie, uh, two years later, Frankie, Brooke, Robin, Chopper, Usopp, Sanji, Nami, Zoro. We also had Luffy. And then we have Tony, Chum Tony, Tony Chopper. Um, so Skype, he Zoro there too. A lot of older characters in here, pretty much. So there's a lot. There's a good bit. <laughs> good bit of four stars in there. I'd say that the odds are still pretty high. You get Law just because he's the only one that's at 1%, though. 
All right, so the whole crew, the original crew, runs in. So again, another same thing. If we're guaranteed another one, the whole trick is to see if we can pull a second one at some point in there, just like we did previously with a double law. Come on, give me another law. Give me that law. Come on, defender, do it, do it, do it. Uh, okay. Uh, Don Creek, okay. All right, cool. Again, I'm, I'm hyped for the cola though. Cola, cola is big. Is, is big blood? Is uh, what is it? Big brain for me. That's cool. Defender flag. Don Creek again. You're not the right defender flag. But if I see a defender flag and I get a law on this one, I'll be happy if I get a law to end this again because it's not guaranteed. If I if I end this with law, I'm cool. Okay, so since the whole crew came in initially. The guaranteed one is probably just going to be all of them. Uh, oh, 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 but it could be a black flag like that. Morgan, okay. Runner, okay. Please don't, don't, don't. Oh, Chopper, no! No, you're not law! Although Chopper's pretty good. Please don't be done. Ah! Chopper is really good, though. I like Chopper. But he is not who I was going for! Come on, give me law. I mean, two laws. <laughs> We're guaranteed a law, right? Whole crew came in again. All right, game. Hit him a pull. Uh, runner here. Okay, buggy. Okay, okay. All right, cool. Give me more three stars instead of two stars. I'd appreciate that. Hot chun. Uh huh. Come on now. You gotta show me those those defender flags. Ooh, I kind of thought I kind of thought for a second. I kind of thought for a second. Looks like I'm just getting my one law. Which obviously it's still good. It's still really good to be guaranteed a unit. So, here he is. Yay, law. All right. So, what's that? 75? I think that's 75. What the? It's maybe that. What? The thing. Okay, so I heard the music like it showed a pop up, but it like it's glitching. Oh, okay. I think it played me the like level 80 pop up when it shouldn't have. <laughs> All right, cool. Well, I guess we'll be right back. All right, so we're back on. Um, Yeah, that was. Pre oh, he is level 80. What? What did I miss? Oh, 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 hold on. I'm crazy. Am I? Okay, hold on, hold on. It's late, so bear with me. <laughs> I'm probably crazy. It played me the level 80 sound because I got him to level 80, which is what I thought was going to happen. But that's... Hold the phone, bro. Okay. Did I pull him in my first summon? I feel like my first summon was bad. And I had two guarantees, and I pulled him once. Um, 60, 70. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. He's 80. Okay. I was just like, wait, what? <laughs> I had the biggest, and I mean the biggest, uh, brain farts. But we good. We good. So I'm going to do one final one. Because I did get the gems just to go ahead and do all of my summons on this banner regardless. And also it's good for me too because I'm, I'm getting closer to getting that scout ticket. So hopefully I can pull a dupe of uh, Luffy or Doflamingo. I actually did pull a Luffy on a single, so I've got him to 90 now? 90, yeah, yeah, 90 for gear four. So if I can get a couple more, we're gonna be, oh, law! Oh, no, Smoker! Uh, no! No! I finally max smoker from uh, playing just online. Like I had gotten at smoker to 100 finally. I don't know where he was at from my pulls, but I don't pull smoker very often. And you give me him? What? What is that bait? That is the definition of bait. <laughs> I got so happy because I saw the defender flag. No. No! Ah! Oh. That's so unfortunate. 
Well, hello, Ace. Let's go. Let's go. All right, what level are you now? Like 87? Oh, 83. Whoops. Grossly overestimated that. Okay, well, let's take a look at uh, at Law here. <laughs> uh, okay, so he's a defender, so that's good. Uh huh. Oh, I have enough for level 5. I'll look at that in a moment. So there are the stats for you guys, as he is. I mean, it's not a huge deal. So the skills, vroom, a mid-range area effect that temporarily applies debuff and – no, no, applies defense, excuse me, and speed debuffs to the enemy. The debuff will be removed after a certain period of time. So they did mention that these are supposed to say one through five, obviously. <laughs> um, but, okay, so let's go down all the way to level five. 30% defense and speed debuff. Wow, okay. It only apparently only lasts for a couple of seconds, though, so you've got to pretty much go immediately into an attack, it looks like. But that's a pretty significant debuff. Cooldown is 32 seconds. They've got to... Okay, this Gamma Knife has got to hit really hard. Although, I don't really say... I don't want to say really hard. It's just got to be usable, right? In a different kind of way. Uh, it looks like it hits really hard, by the way. <laughs> it looks like it hits really hard. 738 for step two. Okay, yeah. Moves towards the enemy at long range and attacks with a chance to stun. Cool. The lower this character's remaining HP, damage dealt is increased. Nullify stagger for a set period of time. This looks like it's going to hit so freaking hard. And on a defender character, that's crazy. I'm actually kind of tempted to pull for more, more uh, laws now. Okay. Skill one uh, is just nothing. Uh, step two is skill attack. Oh, I, I think I think the step one is just the the moving. So anyway, step two, seven thirty eight increased damage when HP is decreased. Uh, stun long activation probability one hundred percent. Okay, so it has a it says it has a chance to stun, but it has a one hundred percent chance to stun. Like it's gonna do it, <laughs> and it's gonna do it for seven seconds. My God. Team boosted, attack boost. Not many traits. Uh, when in the area around your captured treasure, reduce damage received by 30%. That's traditional defender stuff. When your strength is less than 30%, boost attack by 30%. So strength, I don't know why they call strength strength. But then for like trait two, they mention HP. When HP and strength are the same thing. When you KO an opponent, recover 15% of your HP. Oh my god. <laughs> oh, okay. When using skill one, boost defense by 20%. Oh, okay. That, okay, so he debuffs them and buffs his defense. His normal attack got to do a good bit of damage still, it feels like. If this is only for a couple of seconds, that's incredibly gimmicky. But if it's any longer than that, it's actually incredibly detrimental to the opponent. So he's actually... He's not... Okay, so from what I can see on the surface, obviously we got to use him, right? On the surface, he looks great. He doesn't look like incredibly game breaking or anything like that right i think i think if i had to tier him he'd probably be probably about s minus i think s minus or a plus they're pretty much the same thing anyway is about where i'd put him with the maximum being s plus so s minus s the s plus the highest um but that's just me looking at him here right so overall though incredibly excited for this also very excited for the zoro that'll be coming out soon i can't tell you i won't do any more summons personally i might but We'll see. So I wanted to go ahead and train him. So I was like, you know what? I might as well just take him into solo really quick and show you guys what he could do before we get out of here really quick. So we're not going to spend a whole lot of time here, but I just wanted to see how his skills work. Okay, let me see how long that is first. Uh, okay, so it is only for a short period of time. I wonder if they have to stay in here, though. Oh, wow. Okay. That's really cool. So if they stay in the room, which is obviously what you'd expect, then they obviously are able to sustain that. But if they get out, it goes away very quickly afterwards. Gotcha. Okay, that's pretty cool. So I'm actually going to wait for that to charge back up, and then we'll use his Gamma Knife afterwards. Okay, so here's his single tap. Here's the double. And here's the triple. If I can attack Kobe, thanks.
That's not the triple. Here it is. There we go. All right, so let me go ahead and get the room back up. Room. Oh, okay. Oh, that's cool, too, because they can enter it from there. It, okay, so it stays up for a good bit of time, too. Looks like it's about 10 seconds or so. That's pretty cool. Unless I'm, like, totally miscounting that. Again, I've had a couple brain farts in this video anyway, so bear with me. Can you not? Can you not? Stop. Stop, please. Nobody wants to deal with that. All right, so for the next thing I want to do is show Gamma Knife by itself without the room. Because we've actually already kind of seen enough of the room pretty much. Okay. Thank you. Okay. What's with all these guys with guns, bro? Oh, great. Okay. Although I will say, um, I think I'm going to set up room here. Just so I can pretty much one-shot the buggy. There we go. I'm just going to hide here and wait for Butchie and them to come. All right. Enter my room. Enter my room. All right. So just about back. Okay, Gamma Knife is back. Oh, okay. It has decent range. It hit all three of them. That's pretty good. Although I would like to... Okay, so we're going to wait and, and get it one more time. Because I would like to see how far I can be and get to them. So we'll do it one more time. I got to wait for it one more time. Although, Law is like... It seems like he's made for this. Because, right, it doesn't he heal whenever he KOs an enemy? Like, he, <laughs> he's going to be able to body this at, like, a decent level. All he has to do is be able to do the damage, which... He can actually debuff the defense, so that's cool. Hey, okay, see, like, right here. Oh, my gosh. <laughs> right here, he's getting bodied. Because he can't do any damage. He's taking a lot back. All right. Also, the speed debuff is nasty. That's the most important thing. Look, look what happens to them. They just move so slow. No, you need to stop. Okay, are you done? Are you done? Okay, as soon as I beat this batch, my Gamma Knife should be back, and I'll test it out from there. Actually, maybe I can get Don Krieg if I move out of the way a little bit here. I'd like the Gunner guy to stay back there and go for him, to be honest. That'll pretty much be good. Ah, oh, he's coming to me. I might as well just finish him off. All right, and they'll actually spawn behind where he is now, so that's good. Let's see. Okay. So that, oh, and, he, and there's a stun on the other guy. Not bad. Not bad range. How long is that? Okay, it, it's off now. Okay. Also, again, th this is just level one on the skills and everything, so keep that in mind. Things could be subject to change at higher levels. So anyways, there you go. A little bit of a preview for this man, because I don't know... How long it'll take me to do some gameplay. Anyways, thank you all for tuning in. I hope you guys enjoyed. And I'll catch all of you guys in the next one.